to start off, give a special thanks to Shabard Nigdo and Sierra McCord. And a bit of a disclaimer, it was Sierra McCord's whiny fun videos that actually inspired me to do the previous one. This one, shout out to Shabard Nigdo Xingyan for letting me know the previous one had shit quality and vocals. Or too much sound from the uh, game. Starting off, these are just my thoughts on Well, oh, feminism is much like a religion. I'm going to start off with indoctrination. No, no, no. Which is like saying, you know, heaven is only obtainable if you're a good person, or to kill an infidel, and stuff like that. Well, feminism, it's a feminist utopia. Funny, true thing, what is a utopia to some? Differs upon person to person. Each person has their own defin uh, well, vision and definition of a utopia. Every religion has truths. Like they say, um, God exists as a kind, caring individual, much like a father figure or a mother figure. He created all life in the universe. That's all there is to it. Feminism, it's all these myths about the wage gap, women being discriminated against in the West. Not realizing that discrimination is going to happen no matter what. At least. Um, point. I think it was point of one of men are actually misogynist. I think it was. I actually have a hatred of women. Well, feminists, pretty much. Boop. All men are rapists. All men are misogynists. You can't change my mind. Next thing, guilt. Well, this kind of goes with coercion. They make you feel guilty for not being a part of this grandiose thing. The ultimate truth. The ultimate religion. The ultimate whatever. The thing perfectly designed for you to be happy throughout your life. Seriously, I've been through this whole stupid guilt thing. And it's like, um... So, you know, you'll be happy throughout for your life. But they say you can't do it without this thing. You can't be happy in life without this. You know, for 13 years, I've been happy without... Going back to church. For 10 years, I've been happy to say that I don't believe in God anymore. But during that, the only times I've ever been unhappy was just plainly when I felt alone. That's it. But before that, I used to whip the fuck out of my back. I'm surprised my spinal cord hasn't severed two for how hard I fucking swung the goddamn leash. One thing I'll say though is religion's not for everyone. Feminism will always say that everyone for equality is a feminist, not realizing people like me exist and say that if that's true, then for not believing God, you're a devil worshiper. I'm okay with being called a devil worshiper. I don't mind playing the villain, so I keep stating it. Over and over again, everywhere. It's a fun phrase to say. It just means that it's okay to be for me to be a scapegoat because it's idiotic to always blame everything on me. Like Sam White. I don't know, he was fucking everywhere. I mean he was at the San Bernardino shooting and he was home at the same fucking time. Hmm. Didn't know he was there. I mean I thought it was Saeed Farouk and his wife. At least that's what the news keeps saying. Sorry about that. I've been like yawning during the whole thing because I'm trying to keep my in, like, keep hydrated. The, the way you could point it out as a religion is actually another thing. And this one is heavily, heavily there. Big scaly wool we call intolerance. And that word is only scary because 
No way in hell. What if I must ever believe a feminist is wrong? Although they will, if they say certain things, say they're wrong. And say they're not a feminist, they're an anti-feminist. Take Christine Hoff Summers, for example. Branded as an anti-feminist. Just like, um... How Protestants aren't viewed as Christian. Seriously. Some Protestants worship God, like the Christian God, yet, yeah. People are intolerant to them. Same with Muslims. If Muslims saying Islam is the true religion, and then a Christian comes along and they behead the Christian because they wouldn't pay a tax. Tolerance is a one-way street. With two cars going into the one way, two different directions. Because the thing's big enough, but it's still just a one-way street. It's also known as bigotry as well, but, you know, nobody ever had any differing opinion of feminism, right? Right? Like, I mean, or Christianity, right? Right? Or, no one's ever criticized Islam and said that Muslim isn't, Muslim, no Muslim isn't a race, it's a damn religious sell it or a religious person and it's Arab or Middle Easterner that is the people of there hmm racist who criticizing Islam much okay moving on I'm gonna just say this and stop where I'm at now while I'm trying to do my dick hard impersonation it's the impersonation I do for playing Order and Chaos. Get cowed. Uh, hope you all have a wonderful night. One thing I will say though, if you ever come across a feminist who says that you don't like feminism and they say you're misogynist, tell them since when is feminism just one gender? It pisses them off more being reminded that they're male feminists. Unless they're male feminists. 